Are you serious? Are you serious? Microchips RFID has it begun? What? Well, I mean, not the mark of the beast, but has the technology of the mark of the beast begun? I know that it's available, but I just received a report from Ember of Arkansas and Bill Ward of Illinois. And let me just show you right here. Here's a man actually getting a RFID microchip implanted in his right hand between his thumb and his first his index finger right there in the uh, gap between your thumb and your finger what well listen to this Fox News reporting um, uh, from cartoon characters to celebrities faces and misspelled sayings these are some strange tattoos out there but one man may have made it to the top of the list Anthony Antonius barely winced as a Brooklyn body modification specialist cut open the skin between his thumb and his finger and uh, put in a uh, 0.75 inch blade inserted a small RFID microchip the microchip is the size of a grain of sand and it was encased inside a glass capsule before being placed under Antonio Antonius, his flesh. Now, um, so why did he do it? Why did Antonio do it? Why did he go through th 30 minutes of pain to have a chip inserted into his hand that's completely invisible from the outside? Because the chip stores one gigabyte of data and contains information for the GIF, that is, a readable by cell phones. Think of it as a changeable digital net uh, art tattoo uh, fixed with information. The GIF is a, uh, it's full of uh, rainbow colors. It appears on the screen when incompatible smartphone is held two centimeters from the chip. What? Why are we doing this? Why are we linking microchips to our cell phones, to our iPhones? Why would you do that? What's going on? Is it so you can download information from the from your iPhone to you, or is it so you can be identified? Uh, is it part of the market? What's the Bible say is going to happen eventually? And in Revelation 13, the Bible says, in Revelation 13, and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause. As many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. And he caused them all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is six hundred, three score, and six. Now the Bible also says next chapter, Revelation 14, go to verse 9. And the third angel followed uh, them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast and his image, and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of indignation, and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. And the smoke of the torment is set up forever and ever, and they have no rest day nor night, who worship the beast and his image, and whosoever receiveth the mark of his name. Are you serious? Now, I'm not saying that Antonio Antonius has received the mark of the beast, but certainly the technology is available. In my book, Mark of the Beast, RFID, I explain all of this, the technology, the biblical prophecies, the current world events, how it relates to Bible prophecy, and, and, and an unbelievable end-time apocalyptic scenario. Yes, we talk about the mark of the beast in that book and how the RF 
ID. Microchip plays a major role. Don't miss my show. It starts at 12 noon Eastern. We'll talk about it in this three-hour show today at PaulBigleyProphecy.com. That's www.PaulBigleyProphecy.com. Please get saved. Repent of your sins and ask Jesus into your heart and be born again. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.